Hello everyone. Um, I guess I wanted to again say thank you for everybody giving me support and prayers and just amazing words from people, you know, that I hang out now and that I haven't seen in so many years. Um, thank you for all the funds so I could go and have this treatment done and now I am back uh, in Chicago it's been already a couple of weeks and I took my time to make this video because um, you know I was still not feeling so great uh, lack of energy and um, you know some pain still um, <clears throat> So I'm kind of dealing with that still but uh, the treatment was quite amazing and um, there's some like results that were shown right away because my cancer was um, metastatic on the skin and now it's not there anymore so it's very visible now the other stuff uh, we have to wait till September, beginning of September, to get a scan, CT scan or PET scan, I'm not quite sure yet. But um, so we can see what the progress is. The whole the immunotherapy that was, you know, uh, injected everywhere takes time to work. It doesn't work overnight, so it takes time. But I just have to say that the whole experience was amazing. Uh, you know, God has blessed me with everything that I experienced and <laughs> that I went through to learn to, you know, grow and to realize that really we should all just be thankful for what we got right now. So, <clears throat> I am, I am here and I'm now and I'm, and I'm feeling good. Um, you know, sometimes I push myself too much and then I lose a lot of energy. So, you know, I take some days to just relax, like, to, like today. Uh, my family's out, you know, and I just stayed home, relax and take my time. And that's why I wanted to make this video. So, again, uh, Dr. Jason Williams, he's an amazing guy and he really he really helps people and the doctors that he works with in mexico are amazing people as well uh even one doctor dr um <clears throat> margus he sat down with me before my third procedure and he prayed for me which i thought it was very amazing because he noticed that you know i I am, I am a believer, so I believe in God. So he literally sat down and prayed with me. And he's the main doctor of the, that hospital in Mexico. So very lovely people, very, very, very lovely people. Very, you can feel all the faith, all the goodness in their hearts, very warm. And I really appreciate everything they did for me and when I got the infection, they were on top of it. You know, they were like doing everything they can. Dr. Williams, he already scheduled, uh, you know, for me to see the wound specialist here. And I went to see him two uh, week and a half ago and he was thrilled with the results and how it looks and how the wound looks and, you know, how it's healing. Of course, my oncologist wasn't so happy that I went, but you know, at least I'm grateful that he's um, willing to talk to Jason, Will Dr. Jason Williams. Um, and you know, other, uh, f you know, people that I know that are also in, 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 in medicine, they were very impressed with you know the treatment that i received so i really i really believe that this will be the future future 
treatment of any type of cancer, I really truly believe that. And I hope that that will happen soon and that it will be available here and everywhere around the world. So we'll see. And praise to God. So uh, anyways, so I'm sorry, I'm a little emotional because there's so many people reaching out to me that are in the same problem like I am. And they wanna go. But you know, sometimes there is a solution, other times there is no solution. And um, hopefully more people will find out. I actually had a woman on Facebook reach out to me and she found out about him four years ago when she was first diagnosed with breast cancer. So there was no metastasis or anything. And she went straight there to see him. And she's been, you know, she didn't have to do so many treatments, waste so much money. I mean, not waste, don't get me wrong. You know, what's the cost of life? I don't want to say waste so much money, but you know, put in so much money for her health. Um, <clears throat> and she's been cancer free for four years. So, you know, I really do think that this should be the first that you do instead the last thing when you're trying to save your life. Because, you know, at that point, it's a challenge. It's a challenge for us. It's a challenge for Dr. Williams. And it's a challenge for God. So, I wish, I wish I knew four years ago. <laughs> I would go right away. I wouldn't think twice. But I had to go through this healing journey and um, I learned a lot. And whoever needs advice and needs help, you're welcome to contact me. I'll do whatever I can. Again, very grateful for all of you guys. Grateful for God taking me to this magnific magnificent place on my healing journey. And I pray for great results in September. And I will let you know. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Have a great day. Bye.